Hey, it's Dr. James here. Good morning. I hope this message finds you very well. You're happy, you're thriving. And what's really awesome is that um, we have so much to say about what it is that we get done and what it is that we also don't get distracted by. It all comes down to willpower in so many instances. And um, I'm having a blast reading everything by this researcher, Roy Baumeister, who's this really this awesome person who's all about studying how it is that we can create willpower. I did a piece a couple days ago on the morning and its relationship to really leveraging the neurochemistry of what's already happening and how setting goals first thing in the morning can be just phenomenally powerful because so much of what's already moving in our chemistry really supports you in following through and being courageous and being creative in your thinking and your follow through around willpower. Well today I'm going to share another pearl with you which as I find fascinating and um, I'm a big fan of how it is that you begin your day it has a lot to do with how you ended your day the night before and particularly in your office as I'm coming across more research that speaks to the fact that one of the key distinctions of great willpower first thing in the morning when you enter your office space or your workspace the place that you create your epic living laboratory is all about the tidiness of your desk yeah Oh my gosh, just tidying your desk. So here's a ritual that you can do that actually works with the prefrontal cortex, that amazing part of your brain who is just awesome and in charge of all the greatness that you want to be creating and also in charge of your willpower. She loves a tidy desk. And what's really, really cool is two things that you can do. And here's some tips that will really help to help you leverage your willpower. First and foremost, when you're finishing up your work day, before you close down, shut off your computer, and head out of the office, absolutely tidy up. Clean up your desk, put things in piles, put stuff away, have a clean slate. Because there's two things that will happen here. Number one, another great study comes out and says that when we clean up our workspace or clean up our area and our environment, it actually helps us to sleep better. How cool is that? And the following morning when you walk into your workspace and the desk area is tidy, your willpower is going to be engaged right from the get-go. It, it tends to be that if we have a mess or things are disheveled in our, in our atmosphere, we tend to lose our willpower. We tend to feel distracted, we feel disempowered, and we're kind of disenchanted with ourselves. So if we just take one to two minutes at the end of our day and pristine our world, there's an epigenetic experience in terms of what it does from our standpoint of how we show up genetically, but there's a phenomenal experience in terms of how our willpower responds to a nice detoxification, if you will, a cleansing of our space. So you and I, we get an opportunity to tidy up. When we do that, our willpower flourishes and we get to create an opportunity to build a life that we love every single day. So have an epic Wednesday. Much love, many blessings. I just absolutely enjoy your connection and uh, rock it today. Take care. Bye-bye.